My name is Ted Chilowitz. I'm from uh, Red Digital Cinema. We, uh, we make this little baby that's floating right next to me here, uh, the Red One Digital Cinema camera. Shoots 4K resolution. Thousands of these cameras have been shipped all over the world to 67 countries at last check, uh, shooting hundreds and hundreds of feature films in the last year and television commercials and uh, an ever-growing crop of uh, episodic television, and music videos, and you name it, nature programs, uh, underwater, big budget movies, micro movies, indie movies, there's almost nothing this thing hasn't shot and it's only been shipping for about a year. So this is the uh, early prototype version of today's Scarlet. And if you go to the red.com website, you can learn all about what we're doing with Scarlet and with Epic. The Epic body is only slightly bigger than this and slightly deeper than this, but they're gonna shoot even higher resolutions than the Red One, actually significantly higher. So in this little body, we go 3K, 5K, and 6K. So much, you know, essentially double the resolution of the Red One, which is pretty incredible. This is uh, about a 12 megapixel sensor, and we're gonna go to a 24 megapixel sensor in 6K, at up to 100, uh, up to 100 frames a second in Epic, and um, 30 frames a second at full res in Scarlet, and 60 frames a second in, in 3K mode. Pretty incredible. On a body that's obviously much smaller than the Red One, um, and because this is our first generation product, this is our second generation product, there's some significant advancements other than just the tiny size, right? So um, you start out with Scarlet at 3K, does uh, 1 to 120 frames in 3K resolution, which is two and a half times that of 1080p, for a price of $2,500 US dollars. And it uses a two thirds inch broadcast sensor, you know, style sensor, professional camera. Um, then we, in this same body, we'll also put a 5K sensor in it, or a 6K sensor in it. Um, and then as we move up the food chain to the Epic, sort of the super professional version of this very small body style, we start at 5K, we go to 6K, we go to 9K, and we go to a medium format style camera, which is 65 megapixel. And even in the sort of rarefied air of how far we can take this, we have what we call a 617 camera, that's 28K resolution. So the sensor itself is six centimeters by 17 centimeters. It's like two and a half times IMAX film frames, right? And we're able to shoot that cinema style at 25 frames a second. So the, the beauty of everything we do at RED is everything centers around this RED code technology. So the back half of this camera has a very, very advanced codec system. It all happens in real time. And it takes the raw data and writes it while it's still raw to either a compact flash card or a, or a drive pack, which you can see over on that camera over there. Uh, that could live down in this little cradle here. And we're able to record it on board. The new generation of cameras will also have even more advanced onboarding recording options that are fully removable and changeable as the technology advances. But even at that 28K rate, because we use the red code, the, the data rates, which would be completely unattainable if you were doing full raw capture. I think there's one other camera, there, there's one other camera on the market that actually can record one frame per second that way that exists now. We're going to do 25 frames a second at the full resolution. And then we can extract, say, 9K at, I think, uh, I want to say 50 or 60 frames a second that way. So full on cinema at these massive rates, all because of what we do inside this specialized wavelet technology we call Red Code. So big has a different concept to us big resolution without big files. 